Is this yours? Yes. This is so cute. Three local oh, high school students are getting expert guidance from a famous fashion designer. Do it in the back for me. I can just fold this over. Cincinnati native Asha Ama has appeared on Project Runway, designed for celebrities, including Zendaya, taught a master class, and even had a hand in a recent Cincinnati ballet premiere. But behind those showy scenes, she's quietly sharing priceless so right expertise with young women. The older I get, the more I realize I was afforded a lot of opportunities that black women don't get, especially young ones. And then, of course, getting these big opportunities can really change the trajectory of your life. She says her hardworking parents opened many doors. There's no reason a girl who grew up in Avondale, whose dad was a bus driver, should have gone to St. Ursula Academy. But because he put me in those rooms, he knew that if, you know, someone gave me the ball, I could take it all the way. Now, Asha is handing off the ball to Makita Bird, Erica Franklin, and Dabu Fall. That's beautiful. Okay, show us your stuff. While she's providing a launch pad, these high school seniors are fueling their collective passion with a lot of hard work. And this one's made out of old curtains I found at the thrift store. And next to them I have um, where I planned out the patterns. She is, you know, ambitious. She's relentless in the pursuit of what she wants. Dabu's a senior at Walnut Hills who already has her own small business. It's an example of something I make for my small business called Soche. A lover of all things retro, Dabu sells her fashions on Instagram. We do uh, custom orders, like custom bags, clothes. Um, we do dresses, too. At the moment, I'm making a prom dress for someone. Erica is a homeschooled musician who's fluent in German. She runs her own design business on Etsy. Here it says Fanny So Fab. And the message through my brand is to carry your confidence. I love that. Erica created a cartoon character to carry that message. If you guys don't know, only 5% of cartoon characters are black. She's like such a fashionista. But she came in and she quietly got to work and she doesn't complain. And she's so respectful and sweet. And even in the midst of like showing up and doing all of this work, she has like her own fanny pack collection. And it matches my dress. Yes. Look at that. Oh. She's had like these pieces on celebrities like Kalani, but she's so humble and sweet. And Makita is finishing up her senior year at the School for Creative and Performing Arts. I'm a costuming major. Last year, my costuming teacher gave me the opportunity to take the lead and take the reins on sewing our scarecrow costume. Makita has also taken the reins on runway shows for Asha. She was mighty and powerful and intelligent and could command a group of people that were older than her. I had people that were older than her coming to her like, what do I do next? I was able for the first time in my life to sit in the audience and watch my fashion show because I trusted her that much with my back of house. It might be uncommon for young people to set a career path at a very young age, but these girls say they were always inspired. I honestly remember the first time I ever started sewing. I was eight and I just found my mom's sewing kit and I just started sewing into one of her scarves. I love working like runway shows. I've done a few shows on my own. It's something I've been involved in since I was like 10 or 11. As a mentor, Asha's providing a path for them to reach those dreams. That really gave me a chance to see where I wanted to be as a designer. And I, it really opened my eyes to the design world and I'm super grateful for that. And their hard work is paying off. All three are accepted to college design programs. They all received 17 under 17 awards from the University of Cincinnati. And Makita won a full ride to the UC DAP program following in the footsteps of Asha. I see myself starting my own brand. I see myself working for celebrities. My ultimate goal is designing for Beyonce. I love to travel, and so I love to see like different cultures because every place you go to, there's always a set culture and fashion. And it'll be nice to see the different ones. My ultimate goal is to keep being better at everything that I do because I've learned that when I do that, like I've reached goals that I never even could dream of. From breaking news to feel-good stories, Local 12 has it all. Tap subscribe and click the links for more content like this.